Hello, this is Lars from Native Instruments. In this video, we will explain how to resolve the could not be loaded error which appears when attempting to load a preset from the Machine browser. Here, we will cover all possible situations that can lead to this error and resolve them in three steps. When the error appears, close Machine and open Native Access. Firstly, we want to ensure that both Contact and Reactor are installed as they are required to load many of the instruments that come with your complete bundle. To do this, navigate to the Installed Products tab and check that both Contact and Reactor appear in the list. In our example, Contact is already installed, but Reactor is missing. If they do not appear in the list, you will find them in the Not Installed tab. Click Install to start the installation. Now, open the Install Products tab and scroll through the product list. If you notice any entry marked with a yellow Repair button, this means that this product has been deleted or moved after installation. In order to be able to use this product within Machine, you need to repair the installation. If there is a Repair button, click it. If you know where the missing item is located, choose Relocate and navigate to the new location. Choose Reinstall if you don't know where the missing items are located or if they've been deleted. This will reinstall the plugin in the location you have set in Native Access Preferences. Repeat these steps for any products that show the repair button. After repairing the product, or if no repair button appears, click on the product which is mentioned in the error message. Under Installation Path, take note of the VST64 location. We will need this later. If no VST64 location appears, it is because this product does not include a dedicated plugin, but requires contact or reactor to run, which we've already ensured are installed. Now, start Machine 2 in standalone mode. You can find the application in C Drive, Program Files, Native Instruments, Machine 2. Open the Preferences and go to the Plugins tab, then Locations. If you had previously noted a path which is not listed here, click the Add button, navigate to the noted location, and select it. Once the path is listed, click Rescan. When the scan has finished, take note of all the paths that are listed here. You might have to add them again after the next step. Now, close the preferences and try loading your presets again. If the error should still appear, we will need to reinitialize the Machine 2 database. Close Machine and navigate to the hidden App Data folder. You can do this by opening a Windows File Explorer window, typing the percentage character, local app data, then the percentage character once again into the address bar, and then hitting Enter. Next, navigate to the Native Instruments folder, locate the Machine 2 folder, and delete it. Now, when you open Machine 2 again in standalone mode, it will automatically rescan its database. This can take a few moments. Once the scan has finished, open the Preferences, Plugins, Locations, and add all paths that you noted down before which are not already appearing in the list. Once added, click Rescan. Once the scan has finished, you'll be able to load your presets in Machine.